Fortnite has secretly added a way for console players to turn on performance mode and in this video I'll be showing you guys how to do this for Xbox and PlayStation. Before we continue, Merry Christmas! I'm giving away 10 Chapter 5 Fortnite Battle Passes in this video to my subscribers. To enter, all you need to do is drop a like on this video, subscribe to my channel with the post notifications turned on, watch until the very end of the video, and comment down below done once you've finished all those steps, and use code Gloomzy. Now I know this isn't the performance mode you were expecting, but hear me out, if you play on console, this is definitely something you want to start doing normally when you break builds on console there's so much debris on the screen which makes it impossible to see your enemies and on top of this it takes a second or two for all the debris to actually disappear this is a huge disadvantage especially if you're playing against someone on a pc whether you're box fighting or build fighting you're at a disadvantage now with the performance mode turned on for my console, you can see there's no debris when you break any builds allowing you to actually see your enemies when you're fighting and this helps tremendously in battle royale, creative, and even tournaments. Now I'm going to show you guys the simple steps it takes to turn on performance mode for your Xbox and your PlayStation. For my PlayStation players, you need two controllers and two accounts. Sign into your main account with your main controller and load up Fortnite like you normally would play. Once you're in the lobby, turn on your second controller and sign into your second account and you're basically done. Performance mode should be turned on and it works for battle royale but sometimes doesn't work in certain creative maps. If you forget to turn performance mode on, you can do this at any time, you just have to be in the Fortnite lobby. And to answer another question, yes you do have to do this every time you log onto Fortnite. For my Xbox players, all you need is one controller and two accounts. Sign into both accounts. Make sure you load up Fortnite on your second account, this is extremely important. It'll ask which account you want to play on and from here press your main account and you're basically done. The rest of my zero delay console settings will be found at the end of the video, so enjoy me dropping a 20 bomb in the solo cash cup using performance mode for my PS5. There's only three people here actually. I thought the AI was a player, bro. Oh, it is a player. Oh my gosh, I thought it was an AI. Oh, no. Watch out, I'm walking. I don't know if what's a player or what's not a player, bro. Like, I gotta listen every time I do this. There, bro. That's crazy. I don't drop that twenty bomb. Man. These people are just running. Oh my gosh, I'm serious right now, bro. Grapple's so bad, I know. This one's this one's bad, but it has like unlimited shots on it, so I, I think it's better for team for now. This is the kid with the medallion, I think. Yeah, it is. That mythic. Oh my gosh. Alright, it's over. I'm gone. We just beat the game. Might be a 20 bomb now. But that should be a 20 bomb chat. Question is, where's everybody at? I think there's people camping for cash right now. So. What up? 
Right at that top. Get a bot. Jeez, bro. This one just pumped me that hard. I had a feeling he was gonna edit, but I didn't think he was gonna be that dumb, but I guess he did. I'm not sure only bigs actually. How much bigs is it? Oh my gosh, there's so many people here. It's actually a 20 bomb. 20 bomb potential check. Oh my gosh, I just whiffed. I could've killed him. Do I go for island or do I go for 20 bomb here? I need to go for 20 bomb. Okay, that's better. Yeah, 20 bomb, 100%. I'll get the island. I'll try to get the island if I can. No, well, heck no, heck no. I can't get the island. There's no way. I just had to get 20 bomb here. Oh my gosh, I'm canceled the big. That was worth it. I go on. I'll so work. Let's get things see I'm weak. Jump in, go ahead. Oh my god, okay. Need more, need more kills. Need more kills. 32 people left. Oh my gosh, it might be like 25 kills. Oh, who just shot? Oh, I see him. Fucked him. Go for the chest, please. Oh, hawk him. No way. One more grapple, one more grapple, you're dead. Oh my dude, the bullets take forever to move in this season. Twenty bomb please, bro. I need this video. I need Every second I like mess up like that, bro, I feel like someone's gonna die. You know what I mean? Like 20 bomb, you have to be so quick to get a 20 bomb bomb. Get a sniper. Come on, let's go. Keep going. So 27 11, bro. I might drop a 30. Holy. Might be a 30 bomb cooking up. Oh, I'm, dead. oh, I'm actually so. I'm so special for that. Why did I build? Third party coming in. Play time, play time, Bloomsy, play time. It's all you. Drop 20 bomb for the video here. Imagine, imagine 20 bomb video. Do I pop in the open? Yes, I do. This is called the Zen Accusations. Can you leave me alone, bro? All that building chat. Don't do all that. Come on, bro. Oh, bro. Heart shaking. Not heart shaking, but like, I'm like nervous. I just want to drop this 20 bomb for this video, bro. I've been trying to do this for so long. Got some drum as well. Now we know that. Bro, my controller's auto firing. Like, what is that? Please, bro, please just let me get the kill. Best window fighter, NA. What am I doing, bro? I might get snacks playing like this. Oh my jumper. 15, 16 people left. I like 25 possible, I know, but I'm playing scared. I don't want to just jump in now, because, like, it's too risky. Fight's going to take a lot longer, because I don't think I'm going to jump in. Because I can get max pumped like that. Oh my 
guy's the greatest runner, bro. Like, why me, bro? Why do I have to run to this guy? Holy, bro. He actually wants to live so bad. Should I just let him? Where? I don't even know where he is. Let me drop a 20 bomb here, man. I gotta win the game too, right? Just I mean. Okay, four kills. Four kills will come easy, I think. I think if I get two more kills, fully secure it. I should be chilling. Bro, who is shooting at me, bro? Like, I really kill you right now in game. Does he have a sniper chat? What's the odds? My aim is so bad. Oh my gosh. Like, how do you guys think I zen? Oh, bro. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? Like, oh, I'm getting nervous. Drop 20 bombs to win the game. Drop 20 bombs. Oh my gosh, don't, don't, do not edit that. Where's the guy? Where's the guy? Where's the guy? I sold. No, oh, bro. That could have been a 25. Oh, snaps. Oh, this kid's a guru. What is that? Slow ground peeking me. But it's not zone one. Okay, bro. Please don't, don't sell this. This kid's like low ground peeking me, bro. Like, is he real? Play high, play high. Boot cones out, like zone wars. Yes, sir. Break this. Start friend him. Five pressure. Can't heal. Drop down. He's not going to expect to drop down right here. Storm trap him. Storm trap him. No, he's going for height. Why'd you let him height? I don't know. Watch your builds. He has no builds. He has no builds. Nice. Play right here. Nice. Let's go. 21 kill. Gosh, bro. Put down the YouTube video chat. Let's go. Hey. So jumping right into the updated chapter 5 controller settings that have been helping me pop off in these tournaments. Before I show you guys the settings, let me show you guys my controller. This is a regular PlayStation 5 controller, no extra paddles or buttons. The only thing I have is a low-rise Galaxy Control Freak, which you can buy down below in the description. And for my Xbox controller, it's the exact same thing, no extra paddle or buttons. The only thing I have is a low-rise Galaxy Control Freak. But for the settings for the graphics, I have 120 FPS mode turned on. And if you need a good low delay monitor for competitive or Fortnite or even gaming at all, I have one for Xbox, PlayStation, and even PC down below in the description you can buy. But for the brightness, I have mine at 150%, one for the user interface contrast, colorblind mode is going to be off, and then colorblind strength at 10. This combination of graphics on console works really well to see in Storm. For motion blur, make sure you have this turned off unless you get motion sickness. For the audio settings here, make sure you have visual sound effects turned on. For the next page, a secret tip to lower input delay, especially on console and even on PC, is go all the way down to the replays here and make sure all three are turned off. Having your game or your PC store all your replays every time you play adds a lot to delay so if you want to lower input delay make sure these are turned off record replays are off record large team replays are off and then also record creative replays are off make sure you have low input latency mode turned on and right here for the movement a lot of you guys try out my binds and settings and wonder how i sprint and you guys can never figure out how to sprint make sure you have toggle sprint turned on auto open doors turned off and then for mantle activation and hurdle activation make sure these are both on press and hold to jump 
preferred item slots here are my preferred item slots i have shotgun smg these are unassigned and assault rifle in the end and then for building if you want to lower your input delay when you build make sure you have reset building choice on disable pre-edit option on make sure turbo building is on and then for auto confirm edits i play on edit on release and reset on release so this is set at both this basically just makes it where i can edit and reset with one single bind and don't have to press a confirm button for the reticle options here i have my reticle on damage numbers are on the list hits and icons for the feedback 125 percent for the number scale huds at 65 percent with these options turned on and then for gyro settings if you guys don't use this make sure you have this turned off to lower input delay and the same thing applies for the keyboard and mouse settings make sure these are all turned off and at the lowest number possible now moving on to the controller settings tab right here make sure you have controller auto run turned on build immediately builder pro on so you can build a lot faster and then for edit hold time this is like the time it takes for your game to register when you click your edit button so make sure this is at 0.1 seconds slide hold time this is preference at 0.04 i don't touch the camera options make sure vibration is turned off and then for quick weapon beta i don't use this setting i use preferred item slots and for the look sensitivity here i play a look and aim sensitivity both at five and then for my build and edit mode sensitivity multiplier i did update this to 2.2 for both so i did up it but i think at the time of this video when it comes out they should have updated the movement so i'll see how that goes but and then i play with advanced options turned on and then for advanced look sensitivity down here i play a look horizontal and vertical speed both at 43 percent and then for boost i don't have any boost turned on so no horizontal boost no vertical boost no boost ramp time and no instant boost when building you can play with boost if you want a faster sensitivity but it does make you a lot more inconsistent in my opinion now down here for the ads sensitivity i think this is the most important part for the ads horizontal and vertical both are going to be at nine percent and then ads boost is turned off as well so no ads horizontal boost no ads vertical boost and then no ads boost ramp time for look dampening time this is going to be at zero seconds and then look input curve is going to be on linear aim assist strength a hundred percent for the left and right stick dead zone, both are at 10%. And then here are my custom controller binds. You guys can pause the video if I'm going too fast. But I think that is going to be the end of the video. That's basically all my settings, my updated settings that have been helping me pop off in these tournaments. So if you guys made it to the end of the video, make sure you guys comment down below 270k so I know who made it to the end of the video. And if you guys haven't already, make sure you smash that like button and drop a sub. And also use code Gloomzy in the item shop.